Hey guys, welcome to my channel. As you can see from the title of this video, today I'm sharing with you all of my perfumes as well as decluttering the perfumes that I am no longer using. And yes, without further ado, let's get into the video. So yes, if you guys saw my makeup collection video, I linked that down below if you haven't yet. Um, this is where I store all of my perfumes and I I don't wear a lot of these perfumes. Well, I do wear a lot of these perfumes, but I don't wear some of them and that's what we are going to declutter in this video. So yes, so these are all of my perfumes. I haven't bought any perfume except for my Lancome ones, which I'll show you later. I don't buy a lot of perfumes. Most of these are gifts actually from relatives and my mom. When my mom goes to the States, when she comes home, she always buys me a perfume. So anyway, let's begin. This one was given to me by my sister in the States. This is the Daisy Marc Jacobs Also oh Fresh and I do like it. It's super fresh. I'm not, I'm not going to throw this away. Then... As well as this one, this is a new one for my collection. My mom just gave it to me. And again, I don't I'm not going to declutter this one because I love my Marc Jacobs perfumes. Oh, and then this one, I recently hauled this and I bought this myself. This is only one of the two perfumes that I bought myself. And this is the Lancome Trezor in Love perfume and so this is new. I'm not going to give this one away because I like it. And then this one. This is the Touch of Pink by Lacoste and this is my first perfume ever. My mom again bought this for me and I'm not going to give this away because I do like it. Okay, so this one is the Encanto by Sal Salvatore Ferragamo. Um, this one was actually given to me by my sister and I'm going to keep this one because um, out of all of my perfumes, this is the sweetest one but it's still not sick sickly sweet. So I'm going to keep this one because um, it's, it's the most unique perfume in my collection. Then I have another Lacoste perfume and this is the Joy of Pink. This is sweeter than the Touch of Pink one, but I still like it. I, I actually do prefer this one than the other one. Then, now the next one is this perfume by Oscar de la Renta, and it is the So perfume. So, I think. At first, I like this one, but, but throughout the day, this just gets stronger and stronger, and... I only like my perfumes to be subtle, so I'm going to give this one away actually because it's too strong for my liking. And then next is this one. This is by, this is Chloe. Uh, I think this is Roses by Chloe. And I do like this one. This is one of the most subtle perfume that I have. And this is definitely a top 3 perfume for me. So then I have this Rose the One by Dolce and Gabbana. Again, this was given to me by my sister in the States. She didn't like it, so that's why she gave it to me. Um this is one of the This is one of those perfumes that's a bit too strong for my liking, but I still like it. It does not give me headache when I when I put this on I only spray it on the lower half of my body because I don't like to smell it because otherwise it will give me headache but I do like the smell of this one it's just that it's a bit too strong for my liking then another one that is given to me by my sister well, actually my sister gave it to my other sister and then my sister gave it to me because she did she because she didn't like it and this is the Dolce by Dolce and Gabbana and again this has the same this has a similar scent as the as the Lacoste touch of pink and I do like this one but the same with the Dolce and Go, but the same as with but the same as with this one this has a strong scent and I don't spray it near my nose so as not to smell it throughout the day but I do like how this smells it's just a bit too strong for me. Then this one. Then this one is Dark Flower by Kenzo Perfume. And I do like this one. My, again, my sister gave this to me. And yes, it's very subtle and I like it. And 
then this one. This is the Versace Bright Crystal. My sister gave this to me. And as much as I like it, I don't like it as much as the other one. So I'm going to give this one away. I'm going to give this to my mom because she likes this. Then I also have this Lancome Lanui. Uh, Lancome Tresor Lanui perfume and this is the other one that I bought with my own money and I like this because it's super sexy yet subtle and sweet but it's not sickly sweet like Victoria's Secret so I'm going to keep this away so I'm going to keep this one and I also like how unique the packaging is then I'm going to give this away because this just smells like an old lady and this is the S.A. Lauder Sensus Perfume. The one I'm keeping is this S.A. Lauder Pure White Linen because it, um, this one has a strong scent but it's not a dizzying scent. So I'm going to keep this one. And then these are just samples which I like. I'm going to give this one away. And then I like this one as well. This is the Coach. I don't know what, what it's called but I do like this one and I plan on getting... Oh! Oh, I thought it's the name. Anyway, this is the Coach perfume and I do like to get the full-sized version of this one in the future as well. And then this is Pleasures, another Estee Lauder, I'm not sure what it's called. And I do like this one but I'm not going to buy the full-size one. Then I have a mini touch of pink perfume, my sister again gave it to me. And I'm almost out of it. I'm just going to empty this one out rather than give it away. Then I have this one. This was given to me as a gift. This is the Burberry Brit Eau de Toilette. And I haven't... And I just... And I keep it in its box because I don't like it. It just gets strong. Um, similar to the Oscar de la Renta one. This just gets stronger throughout the day. And it gives me headache, so I'm going to give this one away. Okay, and then lastly, I have this set from Victoria's Secret. I got this as a gift. And I don't use it because I just don't use Victoria's Secret because they dry my skin out. And I don't know what to do with this. I might give this on a giveaway. I'm not sure, but I'm going to keep this here for future giveaways, I think. So these are all of the perfumes that I am keeping and these are all of the ones that I am going to give away. And yes, that is it guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, then please give it a thumbs up and I will see you guys on my next video. Bye!